San Jose is coming to the rescue of car owners whose vehicles were totaled by the Coyote Creek flood. It's our top story at 6.30, and KPI X5's Kit Doe on the plan to give car owners free replacement wheels. Here we are six weeks after the flooding in the Rock Springs area of San Jose. They are still trying to get back on their feet out here. Lots of debris, lots of contractors running around everywhere, and we're seeing this. Flood damaged cars just abandoned on the side of the road. The city says about 200 families either lost a car or had one damaged by the floods, and they're going to need all the help they can get. For T. Tran, the flood damaged not one, but two of his vehicles. The 67 year old does not have a lot of money, and so he's tried to fix it himself without much luck. He says the water has ruined the engine. Well, good afternoon. But help is on the way. The city of San Jose announced a new car replacement program for flood victims. First, the city is set to approve the donation of 20 used fleet vehicles like this Ford Taurus. They're typically about 10 years old with well over 100,000 miles. Second, citizens can donate their used cars to Goodwill and claim a tax deduction in the process. Goodwill will help make sure the vehicles go to the neediest families. And I'd like everybody to know that your donation to Goodwill of a car is not a handout, it's a hand up for those in need. Remember that flood victims fund that everyone's been donating to? It's now up to about $6.4 million, which means hundreds of families who lost cars in the flood will get a voucher worth about $3,000. Victims will be able to take that voucher to any of the 61 locations in the Silicon Valley Auto Dealers Association and buy a new car with an employee discount, buy a heavily discounted used car, or apply the voucher towards deeply discounted repair service on their flood damaged car. And so with a way to stretch that money, it's kind of like stone soup. You put a little bit of money and it grows and there's more money and pretty soon people have, have the ability to take care of themselves. We asked T. Tran if $3,000 was enough. I'll get what I get and I'll try not to ask or demand for anything more. And so Catholic Charities of Santa Clara County will be handling the verification process to make sure the victims qualify with their current insurance and income. But the city says if you have not helped out yet, now is your chance to donate your car and help out your fellow neighbor. In San Jose, Kitto, KPIX5.